Energizing your soul through the inspired Word of God, this is your daily devotional reading. This Day with God, a devotional by Ellen White. April 14th, Be His Messenger. Work for the night is coming. Work through the morning hours. Work while the dew is sparkling. Work mid springing flowers. Work while the day grows brighter under the glowing sun. Work for the night is coming. When man's work is done. Be his messenger. And he said unto them, Go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. He that believeth and is baptized shall be saved, but he that believeth not shall be damned. Mark chapter 16, verses 15 and 16. The workers in the cause of God may learn valuable lessons from the instruction Jesus gave to the 70 disciples and from their experiences. These disciples were sent to the cities and villages whither Jesus himself was to follow to awaken an interest in the work of Jesus that the people might be prepared to receive the grand truths that he would impart to them. After these things, the Lord appointed other 70 also and sent them two and two before his face into every city and place whither he himself would come. Therefore said he unto them, The harvest truly is great, but the laborers are few. Pray ye therefore the Lord of the harvest that he would send forth laborers into his harvest. Go your ways. Behold, I send you forth as lambs among wolves. Luke chapter 10 verses 1 through 3. And in whatsoever city ye enter, and they receive you, eat such things as are set before you, and heal the sick that are therein, and say unto them, The kingdom of God is come nigh unto you. Luke chapter 10, verses 8 and 9. This was to be the burden of their message. They were not to lose sight of this message, nor to enter into controversy over matters that were unessential, or that would close the door to the important truths Jesus had bid them teach. They were to teach from the Old Testament, explaining the prophecies of the mission and the work of Christ, and presenting truths that would soften the hearts of the people, that they might be prepared to receive Christ when he should follow. The seventy had not, like the twelve, been constantly with Jesus, yet they had often heard his lessons of instruction, They were sent forth under his direction to work as he himself was working. Wherever they went, they were to sound the message. The kingdom of God is come nigh unto you. All may be admitted into his kingdom who will receive his message and his messenger. This is the day of your visitation. They were to present the truth of God in such a manner that the people might be led to lay hold upon the blessings placed within their reach. This day with God, April 14th. I encourage you to be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Thank you for listening and be sure to join us tomorrow for your daily devotional reading.